I'm here at Smashburger to try the new hot scorching macaroni and cheeseburger. They're gonna smash the mac and cheese and then they're gonna smash the patty? Let's go try it. All right, I got it. Let's go eat it now. Hey everyone, today we're gonna to be checking out Smashburger's Scorching Hot Mac and Cheese Burger. Let's get right into it. This burger is going to feature a certified Angus beef patty, and this is gonna to be topped with American cheese Scorching Hot seasoning, which is like a Nashville seasoning. Uh, usually Nashville seasoning includes like paprika, cayenne pepper, so uh, we'll see what this actually tastes like and how hot it is. And then it's also gonna have crispy mac and cheese. Essentially what they did there was uh, throw a scoop of macaroni and cheese on the grill and then smash it just like their patties. So smash burger, they're gonna smash everything, right? <laughs> and then all of this is gonna be on their artisan classic buns. And since we're just throwing mac and cheese around, if you don't mind throwing some mac and cheese on the like button down below and smashing it, that really helps out the channel. The single version is 840 calories and then the double is 1,190 calories. So I'm not that brave, so I stuck with the single. And then the price for a single is $9.79. Yeah, that's gonna hurt the wallet there. And if you're really hungry and you wanna go for that double, it's gonna be $12.29. Okay, let's unwrap this thing to see if it's picture perfect. All right, let's get that picture up here. Okay, now uh, here is the burger. And uh, let's see if it's actually picture perfect. We have the artisan bun here on top. We're seeing the macaroni and cheese and we're seeing the patty kind of peek through in a couple areas here. Uh, let me see. I don't see any noodles like it is in the picture. Oh, here we go. There's one noodle if you can see it there. To be honest, the picture does look uh, a lot like bigger. It does, I mean, it looks, it looks taller. The, the, the burger looks taller in the picture. So the coloring's all there. You see all, all the elements at least. I'm gonna give this one a C. It's kind of messy overall, and the presentation is just kind of poor, but at least it's pretty close. All right, time to go in with a close-up. Let's go ahead and start by taking the top bun off. Oh, all right, let's see if I can take this bun off here. Okay, wow. Yeah, we've got a lot going on here. We're seeing the scorching hot seasoning all over the top of this, and the macaroni and cheese is kind of like all over the place. I can't really tell what I'm looking at. I kind of see some American cheese peeking through there. Got the noodles from the mac and cheese. It doesn't look as crispy as I had imagined it. I was picturing like a like a layer of crispy mac and cheese. Uh, let's see here. We got some like crisp flakes there. Okay, and there is the bottom. Getting a good look at the patty there. Then we got the other bun there. But yeah, most of the action is happening on top here. As you can see in the packaging, the macaroni and cheese is kind of like all around it. So. Uh, yeah, kind of messy. I also got an order of sweet potato fries. Not a lot of restaurants carry the sweet potato fries, so uh, that's what I got today. That's a good sweet potato fry there. And also got some hay shoes, onion strings, onion rings, horseshoe. <laughs> I also got some hay shoe or horseshoe uh, onion rings here. They're kind of thin and small, a lot different than uh, normal onion rings that you would find, but uh, I am a fan of them. Seasoning on those onion rings are really good. And then since Smash Burger is so pricey, I got my own Dr. Pepper here. If you want to see me tag more food, hit the subscribe button down below. All right, without further ado, it's time to go on for the attack. Okay, um, if you couldn't tell there, I am in some pain here. Oh, wow. Uh, got the eyes run. <laughs> I got the eyes watering. 
I got my nose running. Oh man, my tongue is just completely on fire right now. It's even getting into my throat, like, you know, that choking feeling whenever you eat something too spicy. <clears throat> Give me a second here. <sighs> oh yeah, I'm still feeling the burn here. Yeah. Mm. Oh man. Whew. This is one of the hottest things I've eaten in a long time. Ow. Yeah, this one's hurting me. This one's hurting. All right, I'll try to go over this a little bit. So, yeah, the, the the Nashville seasoning or whatever scorching hot seasoning they put on this thing, it's really on fire. Like, it's really, really hot. Oh, man. I can barely talk. The spicy seasoning they put on this thing is just, like, overpowering everything. You know, everything's just getting pretty much lost because of the, the spicy seasoning. It's just, it's, it's taking over everything. The beef patty does seem to be seasoned well, you know, uh, the cheesiness and creaminess um, is there from the mac and cheese. The buns on this don't really feel like high quality, like a brioche bun uh, usually does. So, um, the artisan buns, not really cutting it or helping this at all in any way. It's been years and years since I've been to Smashburger. They just don't have a lot of locations in my city, so that's why I don't normally go to them. Plus, they don't have a drive through Yeah, I mean, that spicy seasoning just really, it's, it's just... It just overtakes this whole thing. Um, that, that's all I'm recalling right now. You don't get any hints of the American cheese that's on there. If you want a really hot burger, this is going to be it. I'm going to say on the heat scale, this is on the heat meter, this is probably going to be like a 9 out of 10. Definitely hotter than the ghost pepper, chicken fries, and Whopper that I just tried. If you haven't seen that, go check it out. But man, this thing is super hot. I've kind of cooled down, so let me try to go in for one more bite to see if uh, I can get anything else. Okay, on that little bite there I just took, you can taste the mac and cheese. Um, really good flavor in there from it. Uh, the patty does feel like a good high quality patty, certified Angus beef. I believe them. It better be for the price, <laughs> right? I'm going to rate the scorching hot mac and cheeseburger from Smashburger. I'm going to rate it a 6 out of 10. It's, uh, you know, it's okay, you know, but for the price and everything, it's, it's quite pricey. Maybe if they tone down the spiciness of it. Uh, you would be able to enjoy like the other flavors and the mac and cheese and everything, but uh, wow, it is just it is just so spicy and hot. So if you're a fan of spicy things, get this. If not, stay away. <laughs> Go for the normal mac and cheese version. That's gonna do it for this one. I'll see you on the next one.